Hello, welcome in. We're going to show you how to do one of my favorite missions tonight on Villa Gordon, which is the car wash mission. And I can show you how to get all the objectives pretty easily on this one. You can dump three of the cars in the ocean without triggering the alarm, and I'll show you exactly how we go about doing that. So first, we're going to take this excavator or front loader and smash the car that's located in the garage by the racetrack down to the axle. And then we're going to go pick up the tow truck and attach the axle to the sports car and dump that in the ocean. And then we'll grab our little old classic car that's located next to the greenhouse and also dump that in the ocean. And I'll show you exactly how we go about doing that. We're taking we'll smash through this bad boy here. And we'll want to back up and then we'll lower the front loader all the way down. So we're scraping the ground here. Which really smooths that out for any vehicle we take through there later. There we go, excellent. It's gonna be crucial for when we have to go take the old car out of that garage there to the left. And then we wanna go down the hill and then also smash the car that I mentioned that's in here down to the axle. And we'll be doing that by pinning it against the wall over here. Again, lower the bucket down all the way to the ground and we'll smash it, pin it against the wall here. And let's see, once we have this bad boy flattened here, we'll go ahead and hop out of this because we no longer need it. Go ahead and drag this outside. Or like so. Come in. Excellent. Once that's outside, we'll go ahead and grab the tow truck over there by driving this bad boy over. <clears throat> we'll go ahead and pick that up. I'll drive that over to the axle that we now just have sitting on the ground outside the garage. And once we are over there, we'll attach the axle to the top of the sports car with a couple planks, and then we'll drive it over to the ocean. A little unnecessary, but it's okay. And again, we'll hit a plank on this. We'll do a plank on this side. I'll drive this over to the ocean. Should be drivable still. Yep, excellent. We're good. <laughs> We're good! We'll head up over here. We will do drive through the uh, nice little path that we made for ourselves with the uh, front loader. And then if we're nice and careful, we'll be able to drive this right in the ocean. Right here, just go ahead and get out. Hey, there we go. We got two cars in the ocean so far without triggering alarm. I can show you how to get a third, which again will be the vehicle located by the greenhouse, which is over here behind the pool. And we're going to first need to open a hole in this area and this wall as well. And we'll do that by grabbing this loader and backing into the wall as well as that doorway. Avoiding as much damage as possible to the front of the vehicle because that's where most of the vehicle damage comes from when you're driving this bad boy. Excellent. There we go. This is where we're going to take the sports car through, as well as the classic car. So it's crucial that this is not as bumpy as possible. And then we want to take out the edges of this. Perfect. And then I'll show you how to take this door down over here. Oops without uh, <laughs> triggering the alarm as it were. So first we want to take the box out of the back of this. We want to close the trunk. You take your blowtorch and you can cut this door off without triggering the alarm. You do that by going down this line here, avoiding the far right. And then you take it back, cut it here, and your door is free. Now you can drag this on top of the car like a so. And after it's on top, we want to make sure we plank all four corners. That way the glass doesn't move as much as possible. It still has the tendency to break, so we're going to drive super slow when we do. But this will kind of help prevent as much damage as possible. Because if you do too much damage, it will trigger the alarm. So again, you want to drive slow. I don't know if we can try doing this. We 
Okay, so we can also dump that one if we gingerly dump it and don't break the glass. That's good to know. Go ahead and quick save. Still haven't triggered the alarm. Three cars in. Alright, now that we have three cars in the ocean without triggering an alarm, doing the last three is very easy. I'll just show you the course that I take on the map. So I dump this car into the ocean, and then I have a car that takes me from here to this sports car by the pool. And I drive this into the ocean over here, where I have another car that picks me up and takes me to the classic car. And then I proceed to drive it out the ocean where I dump the other two cars with another pickup car that drives me straight to the getaway. And I'll show you how that plays out. Let's go ahead and save it. Although I think we're gonna get it first try. Easy clap, bro. Woo, let's go. That's how you do it, chat. Take a look at this course here. It's a mighty fine course, if I do say so myself. Pretty right on, pretty much right on the line of the spray paint line. At least at first. Such a beautiful line. Thirteen point four seconds spare, baby. Alright, I hope you all enjoyed the video. That is easily one of my favorite missions in the game so far, the car wash. And next time I will be showing you how to do the fine arts and getting all the objectives on that one, which is also on the Villa Gordon map. So look forward to that. If you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe for more content. And I'll see you guys next time. Alright, peace out. Whoa! <laughs>